TIFU by asking my wife for a paternity test. This didn't happen today, but a few weeks ago. My wife of four years gave birth to our first child last year. Both my wife and I are blue-eyed and light skin. Our baby has a darker skin tone. Over the past six months his eyes turned a very dark brown. I had my doubts. My friends and family had questions. I read too many horror stories online. I asked my wife half-jokingly one day if she was sure the kiddo was mine. She starred daggers at me and said of course he is. I let it go for a while. But I still had a nagging doubt. So right after Thanksgiving I told her I wanted a paternity test to put my doubts to rest she. Agreed. A few weeks ago I came home to an empty house. Wife and son gone. On the bed she left the paternity results. And a petition for divorce. Kid is 100% mine. Now I will only get to see him weekends and I lost the most amazing woman I have ever known. TL. Dear I asked my wife for a paternity test she decided she didn't want to be married to someone. Who didn't trust her? I'm gonna hazard a guess that this is just the tip of the unhappy marriage iceberg. Alternate universe, they gave her the wrong baby, he's still the father though lol. Should have recommended for both y'all to test because accidental baby swaps happen at the hospital. It's crazy to me how there are two seemingly opposite opinions that are both getting upvoted here. Some people say that he should have just swallowed the suspicion and not gotten it done. Other people say he should have doubled down on his suspicion and done the test without telling his wife. You know the child is just an infant. It could simply just have been a mutation. Or maybe you have family members who share the characteristics that your son shares. 100% straw that broke the camel's back. You definitely handled the situation wrong but I'm sure that's not the only reason she left. I strongly suggest you handle this with grace. You have a kid so you're in each other's lives for a long time best thing you can do for everyone involved is maintain a pleasant relationship. Don't be petty and don't make the divorce more difficult than it has to be. It significantly benefits you to be on good terms with her. Probably should have phrased that with how you explained it to use but also using, how do we know? Our baby didn't get swapped by accident? Quote, I feel like a cursory Google search on genetics and dominant recessive genes could have saved you. Some trouble. Oh well. Rip. Have you looked back at either side and see oh hey a grandparent had brown eyes or darker skin? Why did you ask your wife instead of just doing it? You can consent to the testing of your kid's DNA. Your wife wouldn't have to be involved. This is dumb on multiple levels. There is much more to this story. What I would have done. Ancestry DNA kits for Christmas. You all do them and then the child has the benefit of having the info later in life. You would find out immediately that way. And you wouldn't be going behind anyone's back. A simple Google search could have saved you a lot of heartache and possibly your marriage. But I'm guessing this is just one part of a bigger picture. Life Pro Tip If you suspect wrongdoing, don't ask the suspect's permission to investigate. Oh god here come the Reddit relationship experts ready to read 14 levels too deep into this too. Paragraph Post Guys learn to say this, was our baby switched at birth? Reddit has gone fully insane. Every thread ever before this. You must have full communication and transparency to work out trust problems in a relationship. Also Reddit. FTB should have deceived her fully and done the paternity test without her knowing. That sure ought to help the trust issue. Quote. 
did your wife already post about this? I'm no I just read a post from the woman's point of view. Can't blame your wife at all. Honestly Op is an idiot. He could have gotten the test done himself and never told the wife. But no he probably has her doing everything so of course he couldn't do something for himself. LOL. Op you really f up but I understand your line of thought. It makes sense because we were taught genetics in a wrong way and probably had other people. Influencing your decision to confront her. The only thing to do now is apologize forever and acknowledge your big mistake. Try to be a good father and do what you feel is right. You can't change her mind but you can be your best and hope someday things will get better. Stay strong and learn from your mistakes. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epic Heracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.